I just got done watching the most recent episode of Anime Insane Invitational. I've got some dots on it, mostly positive, because this episode was pretty good. For a while, I thought they were in some sort of limbo after what had happened a couple of months back. But nope, we're still doing this. Not that I'm complaining or anything, this is a pretty good show. It's a lot better than its predecessor, for one, but that's a topic for another time. For starters, I really like the way they handled the recast. Paintbrush and Bot's new voices sound pretty good, and the way they approached recasting them feels like it came straight out of a gumball episode. As for the episode itself, I really like the rejoin challenge. A part of me feels like it went a little too fast for the kind of structure it was going for, but eh, it works. I especially like the dynamic between Teapot and Life Ring. They got a really good friendship dynamic in this episode, I hope we get to see that develop more in the next rejoin challenge. Cappy being the one to come back makes the most logical sense, but it also makes her elimination feel a bit less impactful in my opinion. The same goes for when Tessu was immediately eliminated after she comes back. Like, I get why they made that choice, it's just that it feels a little bit too quick. And then again, it just sort of comes with the territory, as this season is a bit more loose compared to this II2, which was very tightly planned, with very specific character arcs and character moments. The animation in this episode was really good too. There was a lot of really good motions in here, a lot of arm waving. I really like the lighting on Indefinite Island as well. It really gives off that gloomy feeling. Overall, I'd say this episode was pretty good. I feel like it could have benefited from a bit more screen time in terms of characters like Blueberry. Blue, and certain aspects of it just felt a little short, but it was a nice change of face from the regular format. Excited to see where this takes us.